clue where Greg is, so we're just going to start without him. Um, today, we're going to be playing a couple courses. The Boston Club by Christian Procanio, or Procasino, that's probably it, right? And The Edge of Wilderness by Aaron Spencer. So they were both um, thrown into the forums over on TGC Tours. And, hey, can you check out our courses? And, you know, back in the old days, we never played any real good courses. We would always play beginner courses, you know, new designers and provide feedback to them and that type of thing. All right. And, you know, we've changed up, you know, what we do. So we're going to end up playing these two. There's not going to be much uh, as far as criticizing other than the bust on the designers because they're both awesome designers. So um, with that in mind, I guess I should open up the golf club. And I've been having problems with the golf club. I don't know what the hell's going on with it and Steam. Seems like I have to uh, restart Steam every every time I go back into the golf club. So, again, I have no clue where Greg is. I just talked to him. Oh, yeah, feed the ball, feeding the dog. Well, that was 10 minutes ago, so I don't know where he is. So, let's see. Check something real quick here. So, I'm going to start this round without him. Hey, Maddie, what's up, buddy? And we'll try out. I see him getting in the golf game. So maybe I'll just wait up. I just saw him pop in the game. Question is, will he show his online eventually here? And he's not on Discord yet. Hello. Hey, man, what's up? How's it going? Just dandy. Yeah, I started the stream at 2, so I just figured. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I am a couple minutes late. Sorry. All right. Um. And I saw you hop in the game. <coughs> Question. Oh, good. It shows you there. So I'll send you an invite. Uh, let's see. Yeah, that Edge of Wilderness is a great course. Yeah, I haven't played either one of them. The other one, who's, who's that by? Boston, Boston Club? Boston Club by Christian Procasino, I think his name is. Oh, and how did you come by that one? Uh, he was in the forums. Oh, cool. So, yeah, so I said, well, we'll just play these two and check them out. Because I know you've played the uh, Edge of Wilderness, right? Yeah, great course. So, you know, and he's been bugging us to put it. All right, let's do it. And, cool. you know, we don't not going to be too much critiquing going on it'll just be playing it and enjoying it well yeah. i'm about enjoying it with my game but as much as you can while you slice it into the rough every five seconds yeah or my heavy uh golden grand day you never know the ball club normal Fairways, firm and fast greens. And we'll just play their conditions. Ball. Done. And 
10 minutes before I put the stream up, Eric went live. Well, that goes without saying. Of course. <clears throat> and remember, we have to have some audio difficulties, so they either can't hear me or they can't hear you. Or... Yeah, I know. Did you, did you schedule that? Set it up that way? Uh, uh, that shouldn't happen for another 30 minutes, though. Oh, okay. Good. And then we'll shut it down and uh, start all over again. All right? Sweet. Sweet. We don't want to break tradition. Blue four. Indeed. <clears throat> Fourth pin is always interesting. They've either done their homework and made it usually kind of challenging, and but still legal, or they've neglected it and it just looks like shit. <laughs> right. Exactly. I don't want to do another pin. Fuck it. First three are good enough. <laughs> So what was it like working from home for a change? I don't start until Monday. Oh, you don't? Mm -hmm. All right, so you had to go in yep. yesterday. Although I let all my staff go at noon, so we paid them through the whole day. But they, they're all they all got lucky though. The uh, our uh, credit card sales are up five hundred percent. I don't know why. So the DC is completely swamped, and they're all going to go work at the DC for the foreseeable future. So they're not going to have to be on unemployment. Oh, good. Yeah. I mean, they're going to be like on their feet all day and, you know, packing and picking and, but hey, it's better than not working. Yep. For sure. Yeah. So that worked out rather well. Oh, so far it looks good and I love the theme. I wonder if this is a real course. The Boston, it sounds like it'd be a real course. I don't know. That's a good question, actually. It's not Maybe. LiDAR, or he would have put an L or something behind right, it. Right, exactly. Maybe it's hey, a... Hey, what's uh, up, man? Hey, Dave. Maybe it's his own approximation of it. I don't know. Is there such a thing as the Boston Club? I don't know. Looks pretty damn good. I like it. Yeah, uh, contouring's spot on. I, I'm dressed rather... Yeah, you're toned mm -hmm. down, man. What's up with that? That's right. All I got complaints about epileptic seizures, right. and I'm just trying to avoid a lawsuit. It's not a real course. Okay. Okay. It looks really good. I like that bunker with the big old mound in front of it. Kind of got, it's kind of a little on the the fairway and the green kind of squarish. Right. Nothing wrong with that, but. He's kind of following a... Well, who else had had a course like that? Yeah. Remember, was everything a... was uh, squares and rectangles. and. It was on the uh, World Cup of Design last year. We, it was in the contest, remember? Oh, yeah. I don't, I, I don't know that it made it out of the second round, but, yeah, it was really interesting. Everything was 90-degree angles or close to it. This is kind of similar to that. I like it. Kind of different. Yeah. Is this hey, your Maddie. course, Maddie? Not your course, is it? I think he meant my, not by. Inspired by Rainer and his other more engineered style architect. This must be his. Well, I like it, Maddie. Oh. One eighty-seven speed. Right, so it's not yours. You just I'm gonna mess it. it. Oh, look at that. Oh, it's not this. Okay. Well, it's pretty cool. Well, at least we're not starting off with a bogey. Hey, buddy, what's up? Hey, what's up? I haven't seen you in a while. I dropped by your stream yesterday briefly. We were designing. Hold on. I mean, actually, why don't I do this here? Can you guys see the course all right now? If I uh, do that, you see the stream, Greg? There's a little delay here. Yep. Is that is that good or? Yeah. He needs a haircut. 
That's pretty funny. Oh, that's all right, Eric. No biggie. I was only in for about five minutes. Whoa. Yeah, that looks great, Kat. <laughs> Love. I don't want to see the fucking course. I just want to look at your face. Excellent. Can you make it bigger? Right. Yeah. There you go. Fucking yeah, that, little, that little... <laughs> <laughs> I'm Jesus Christ. Now, if that was like Jennifer Aniston or some shit, I'd be like all about that. <laughs> yeah, right. But your ugly mug? Fuck no. <laughs> yeah, I do need a haircut, but all the freaking... All the barbers are shut down because of the... The flu, man. I needed a haircut like uh, a month ago. So that bunker right there is pretty unique. It's kind of cool. I think his contouring looks really nice. Oh, look at that shit. The uh, I'm noticing like a like you were saying the rectangular kind of theme going on yeah. here. Every, yeah. Everything fairways, greens, bunkers. Everything is symmetrical, you know. It's, yeah, it's kind of different. Yeah, like for it. sure. I like it. How you doing, Eric? Doing all right? How far are you from uh, Harrisburg? Are you uh, close to that or what? I know you're in Pensy. Oh, is he? I didn't know that. Yeah, he's a Pensy guy with me. Oh, okay. For some reason, I thought he was, I don't know. I had it in my mind that he was in Virginia or somewhere. Okay. No. Okay, so you're 10 miles from Harrisburg, so you're right there. All right. Wow. Yeah, my cousins live up right up near Harrisburg. Well, you guys are practically neighbors. Why don't you Indeed. go shoot, shoot a round of golf Yeah, sometime. it's a little too far to just, like, you know, stroll on up. But I had to drive up there for a job once when I had my business. And it took me about two and a half hours to get to Harrisburg. So there you not, go. It's not a hop, skip, and a jump, but it's not too far away. You guys should play around sometime. You could kick your ass. What? Who? You mean real, real golf? Yeah. Uh, Make it. Yeah. Well, no, I only play with people that I can beat, so I can feel good. Oh, okay. That's why you yeah. play with me. Yeah. So as long as they shoot like 120, 130, we're good. But that would be me then. <laughs> Come out to Illinois sometime. You'll clean my clock. Yeah, Eric. I know for your job. I, I mean, I know oh. you got promoted. So I don't know if you're. Are you still going around to the different hospitals, or what are you doing now? Are you managing bigger area? I don't know. Nice putt. Thank you. Well, anybody could have made that putt. I actually made a good shot, but I shouldn't have said anything because now I'm going to start fast hooking it, and I like the lighting. Yeah, it's it's so funny. I mean, yeah, there you go with the, the rectangular. Yeah, you can see it big time on this. And the overhead, if you hit your uh, B button, big time. Yeah, look at the green. It's very rectangular. All right, cool, Eric. I'm just reading Eric's. Uh, that is cool. There. Yeah, Eric's doing well. Yeah, so After he's, he got that he's, last promotion he's more or whatever. managing now instead mm -hmm. of uh, out knocking on doors. And, uh, well, sorry about that. It's Dogs. just like my uh, brother. He works. He's a he's sales for a uh, huge chemical company. He's been with them for about 10 years. And, yeah, Bavakia. Uh, I do too. This is different. I've I've seen a couple other courses like this. I, we were just saying on the World Cup of Design last year when Kent and I were judges, there was a course and I I can't remember the designer or the name of it, but it it was similar. It was all rectangles and squares and ninety degree angles. Very different. I like it. It's a really clean looking course. Yep. Oh, I like it. I want. Obviously, he's designed other courses. I'm assuming. Yeah, what's his name? Uh, stop, stop, stop. Christian stop. Procasino. Am I still, oh, yeah. Am I pre, uh, pronouncing that correctly? Yeah, on the next T, hit your B button. I, I want to see the uh, 
overhead view of all the I bet the angles really stand out then. His bunkering's really nice too. I like I like how he's built up the berms around him. Don't want to be on the front end of those uh bunkers. Slow. Yeah. I I must have like a superstition of this theme because it's the only course I've built that's not handicapped. It will not. It just won't. I don't think it'll ever be handicapped. And it's the only one I built. Um, notice I said built, not designed. Because of my LIDAR stuff. But Which one is that? It's. I forget the name of it. I, I have to think a mental block. Um uh, it's over in Jersey. That's why I didn't know it. Somebody had requested it. Hmm. Particularly according to videos I've seen, must be at least eight hours from Jamison. Yep. Yeah, my wife went to the University of Pitt. And I think you can get out there in like six and a half hours. She just drove my daughter out there. Um, not just, but three, four months ago. Hey, congratulations, Maddie. That's a good milestone, man. Very Sweet. Cool. Oh, man, look at this. I think yeah, I, could... I mean, I'm laughing with the Philadelphia Country Club. I mean, that thing was handicapped oh, shit. in two days. That was just a wonderful putt, sorry. Damn it. No, thanks to the, uh, the simulator guys. Put it on their tour and add, like, 700 people in this thing playing it. Oh, come on. Come on. Damn it, man. Love Pete. I'm putting like crap. And you're putting quite well. You already went under. All right. I think I can make this one. You got this. <clears throat> okay. Hit, hit your B button off the T here. I want to see the... Uh, bird's eye view here oh yeah look at this the rectangles on this thing very cool it's really different i like it um what do you gotta do what are you gonna do about it i mean how do you zoom out i thought it was by changing clubs well, I was just talking about the B, the B button. That's what Over. I'm hitting, and all I'm getting is this. It just I, I, shows the delay. green with the. Uh... Oh well, yeah, that's yeah, that's true. Um, this is a short hole, so we're not seeing much of it. Right. <clears throat> yeah, you'd have to go to your camera view. Look at all those rectangles. Lucky. Bad. <laughs> You gotta be kidding me. Galen Scaff hasn't gotten handicapped yet. Jesus, I'm really surprised by that. That's a that's a that's a phenomenal course. You remember that, don't you, Kent, mm -hmm. with all the retaining walls? Yep. It's 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 such a dog eat dog world, man. It's just Oh I know. You know? It is. There's so many good designs. The moment. I mean Bavaki, don't feel bad. I mean, Greg has been waiting three years to get his any of his courses handicapped. I mean, he's happy. Right. I think he's up to, what are you up to, like 19 on uh, the course you produced last year? 19 I mean, plays? Stumbling, stumbling Wallaby, I think it has, I think it's up to 22 now. All right, well. Of know. course, 18 of those are me, so. <laughs> Hey, what's up, De Prairie Hawk? Get in there. Stop, it's looking good. Stop, oh, oh, stop. oh, 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 it's going to keep going. Yep. Ouch. Plays. He's talking about plays on Galen Scap, his uh, most recent publish, I believe. Hey, Prairie, what's up, man? Yeah, oh, Bavaki, and we had a we had one of his uh, courses. It's friggin' awesome. Um, how long has it been out? Bavakian. Has it been a couple months now or what? 
Wow, we're putting great today. Jesus. Yeah, I can't. Ten weeks. Okay. I mean, yeah, these greens are. I, this is the first time I've played it. Well, it's funny because I'm when I'm designing these courses now. Um, it's a learning experience, so I'm getting a lot of business from the simulators, the simulator guys. Well, you know me with hard and fast and firm, right? So, of course, I design the courses hard, fast, and firm. Well, they get these hard, fast, and firms with their courses that they, you know, they have me build. And they're like, dude, you know, it just keeps rolling down and I can't make the putts. And blah, blah, blah. I'm like, oh, shit. So I have to remember that, you know, these simulator guys, you know, they want 144s. Yeah. Now hit your B button. Now you can see a lot of that there we uh, go. geometry, I guess you could call yep. it. It's pretty cool. I really don't want to see some of this guy's other courses. No, not Trusim. He's talking about simulators in the bars golf, and stuff. Yeah, you know, the golf simulators, the ones they oh. have in the garages and, you know, down in their basements that cost like 15 grand. Yeah, those. Get out. That's all you can do. Yeah, that if you go to my website, thelidarking.com, I've got about 20 videos. Every time they play one of my courses, they Shit. record YouTube videos of them playing it. And it's cool to watch them. Oh, my God. Look at that. Oh, man, look at that hill. Well, I'm going to try the bunker in the front, all right? You went to the back. I'm going to go to the front. No, I'm not. Very fast. I missed it. Can't even hit the bunker. Well, short is your thing, long is my thing, so. Ain't no thing is my thing. All right, so, <laughs> like... All right, I will nice. take that, or I would have been down near you. Oh, Jesus. 59-foot putt. Okay. Doesn't look too painful, though. Go in. Ooh, almost had it. Good butt. Thanks. Oh, oh back door. <laughs> <laughs> As it gets in there, that's what you Yeah, said. I like this course. And like I said, today is yeah. not a day that we're going to be critiquing, oh, yeah, you need to fix this, that, and the other thing. Both of these guys are excellent designers, mm -hmm. and we knew this ahead of time. So we're just, yeah, this has, we're just this enjoying them. Check them out. And this is definitely yeah. different. This is cool. It, yeah, like, yeah, it is kind of old school, isn't it? Yeah. Very cool. I like his bunkers. That's a big green. All right, Eric. Well, thanks hey, for stopping you, in, buddy. Yeah. Good, good seeing you. Good, good seeing you talking to you. Hello. Shut up, Siri. I didn't say a fucking word to you. <laughs> God, I hate Apple phones. <laughs> and, that, and that's what I have. But that's all yeah. the business offers. So, Who I'm designed blue. this one? I only know his real name. It's Christian Procasino. <clears throat> If you go yeah, you into too, the, Eric. Yeah, if you go into the TGCTours.com. Later, Eric. Have a good good weekend, buddy. Um, if you go into TGCTours.com and you go into our forum section uh, for course reviews, it'll show his forum name as well as Aaron's. Well, it's straight as an arrow. Yeah, that was good. I didn't even see that huge lake back there. Cool. Oh, I still don't have a club for this. Believe, my eyes are bothering me because 
His clothes are so tame today. It's so I'm getting like blurry. <laughs> I know, right? You're used you know? to seeing. You. Yep. I thought I'd play easy on everybody's eyes today. Nice. That's what I'm talking about. Ooh, yeah, I can three putt that. <laughs> Huh. Yeah, I, I, despite my complaints about it, I, I, I do like my, my phone. No, I never liked Apple. Still don't. But I like the bill. Ooh. Oh, nice shot. Thanks. Very nice. Yeah, I'm an Android guy. I haven't had one in since this job two years ago because I, I never... I haven't had a personal phone in 15 years. Oh, just a work phone? <laughs> yeah, I've always had just work phones. <clears throat> the only bitches. Well, not really. I mean, I was able to transfer the number over. So, whatever. I'm not going to pay a bill and carry around two phones in my pocket. Oh, well, it's a good looking par three here. That's a good looking par three. The green size is about right for a 201 yard Indeed. distance. Uh, let me see here. Oh boy. Hope I can get there. I mean, I'm going to be long or I'm going to hit the bunker. Long, long. That's not bad. Nah. That's a tough pin. Yeah, it is. I can see why it's got and a few And you're going with the it. wind, so there's nothing to mm -hmm. stop it, you know? Yep. Uh. Yeah, so whatever, like this, I have no no, sh no shot here. Yeah, Maddie, me too. This is one of my favorites. I can see playing this many Fast. times. Checking out different pins and settings and tees. Yep. I like this course. Yeah. Not that I play any anymore. I mean, this is, this is nice to actually play a course that's fun to play. Instead of, you know, doing the beginner courses all the time. It does kind of look like a redan. It slopes back to front. Break, was, break, uh, break, uh, break. It, straight as an arrow. <laughs> well, there, now it breaks. After yeah, now that. it broke. Of course. Oh, so let me see. I want to hit right edge, I think. You got it. Oh, boy. Well, our putting is just on fire today. Come join me. Oh, God. Look at that. Holy shit. That's a good question. Yeah, I think I still would. I'm more impressed with the uh, surfacing than I am with the uh, aesthetics on this. Although the, the autumn theme makes it look really pretty, but his textures and his... Uh, his uh, design of the, uh, I think that's straight in. Yep, yep. Of the uh, fairways and greens and his whole motif with the uh, sharp angles. That's what I like about this, the playability of it, this, as opposed to the colors. But, yeah, I think I'd like this in anything, really. Well, Yeah, it's all like, about uh, the uniqueness of the course and the... Yeah, very unique. You know... You know the, the color of the trees doesn't really... It enhances it, right? From a aesthetic standpoint, but it doesn't detract. I mean, look at these. This is really cool here. I love how he's got these bunkers, like left, right, left, right. That's very work. cool. Oh wow! You should do Kent particularly in the current situation when time presents itself. I missed that. What's that, oh, Dave? Man. Oh, I went too far right, didn't I? Shoot. Yeah, I fucked it up. Yeah, you should play more. That's right, David. You should. Look at that slow. Ooh. I have no time to play, man. I'm just constantly designing, make, making new courses. It's just whatever. That's why it's good to have this show and 
break it up a little bit. It was up until four in the morning today. Good Lord, are you serious? Yeah. I mean, not that I said, oh, I need to stay up until four. I just couldn't sleep. So I'm oh. like, well, screw it. And then, uh, you know, just stay up and build some courses. Get up there. Yep. That doesn't work. A long par five. Uh, ooh, that's going to be a little long. Of course, I hear that a lot. <clears throat> yeah, I know. Well, you're always in discussions with my wife. <laughs> If you want to call it discussions, that's fine with me. <laughs> Clean it up for the show a little bit. Oh, it stayed oh, off. It did. Oh, shit. Okay, I'm no good at ship shots. Well, that wasn't too bad. That was good. Mr. Prairie Hawk knows his designers. Indeed. And he knows his courses. Chicago Golf Club mixed with a little dye in Oak My goodness. Oh, you were so robbed. Yes, I was. I have to say I'm not familiar with Chicago <clears throat> Golf Club. But I take your word for it. Hey, Sonic. What's up, buddy? Hello. Haven't seen you in a while. How goes it? Oh, very cool. I just love this, love this design. Well, you were under par. Now you're uh, yeah, well, over par. What, what happened? What the fuck did I have? Like... Uh quadruple fucking bogey on that uh, one hole. Hmm. That's unfortunate. Indeed. Well, that's, man, you're hitting a lot straighter today, I gotta say. Well, I'm still fucking wow. up, though. I mean, when I well. really don't want to. Um... Ooh, a little bit of a false front here. Don't be short. Well, you can't help it, but try not to be short. Uh, what? Designing and sucking at golf. Oh, you and me both. Pathetic. Oh, stop. Oh, I'm going to roll down the other side. Yeah, I'll do that. I'll do it right now, actually. Oh, man. I screw myself with these horrible approaches. Leave myself with these long So this cuts. is an is this an RCR? Is what you're saying? I think you're saying it's uh, inspired by okay. Chicago Golf Club. Yeah, I'm looking at some pictures. Yeah, it certainly does. Doesn't it? it resembles it quite a bit. Definitely inspired by. Now it's funny that I did that Davenport I... and you said, oh, I lived there. I forgot yeah. about that. Yeah, I that you were you there. were in Davenport, right? At one point in your life, born and raised, and went to high school and okay. I'm about fifteen. Well, but I, I'm somewhere like twenty years of my life there. No, I'm quite a ways from Chicago, actually, David. I'm uh, almost three hours southwest of Chicago. How far are I, you from Davenport? About fifty minutes. Okay, so you're right on the other side of the border. Yeah, I'm not too far away. I don't get to Chicago very often, though. Not unless my boss forces me to go. 
That's where our corporate headquarters is. <clears throat> nice or, place to visit. But I where your uh, sister invites you. My sister? Oh, that's Detroit. Oh, that's Detroit. Never mind. Okay. Yeah. Oh, that's right. Principal's nose bunkers. Yeah. Oh, I don't think I can use this club. Well, I guess I can try. Oh, you can use any club you want. I would use a lob wedge. I knew that was going to happen. Son of a bitch. I knew that area was too thin for my... Oh, well. Well, I'm going to go with my driver. Let's, <laughs> let's Here's see. the guy off camera talking. That's Kent. No. I never played the Harvester. And I used to live in Des Moines for about 14 years. Back in those days, I wasn't golfing much. Is it going to get up there? No. It is not. Son of a bitch. I knew that was going <laughs> to happen. I leave myself with these ridiculously long putts. God. Oh, it's 113 feet. Well, wow, that's not bad. Holy shit. You got this. Bam! Will it get up there? Oh, it stayed. Okay. Wow. Three feet uphill. It's about a hundred foot putt, isn't it? Yeah. Ninety? Yeah, ninety feet. I don't know. This is a tropical delusion here. <laughs> Looks like a... Uh... All right, well, let's see what we got here. One of the more got... challenging greens on this course. Stroke index of 18, really. I'm surprised by that. Oh! oh! Man, you had the line. You oh, my had the God, man. That should have been in. That That's was a hell said. of a putt, Kent. Boy, thank you. It's not going to break, is it? It is breaking. Oh, there we go. Got the par anyway. I can make yeah. it for birdie. Matty, yeah. This this guy knows his golf course design. And he knows his golf courses. He knows his designers, obviously. This is fucking phenomenal. Look at this with the two uh, mm -hmm. penis shaped bunkers on the right and the. Uh, oh, look at that trench he's got there. Oh, man. That reminds me of oh, some green. I can't remember the green. I, I've seen a green like that before. Trench dividing it in half. You well, guys probably know out there. Guys are finding out with the LIDAR. They think that, you know, hey, Kent, you know, I'll pay for the course. It's like, no, you won't because it's not available. You know, there's, there's even in the United States, I mean, there's, there's only about 50% LIDAR coverage in the United States. So, a blare you know, screen. It, it sucks. But Thank you. There's a what is it, a Biarritz screen? A who to what? It says with the trench in the middle, they called it a Biarritz screen. Am I pronouncing that right? Sir Joseph, yeah, it, it takes a while to get the hang of this thing. Sir Believe Joseph, not, what's up, buddy? Kent used to be on the Euro Tour. Well, I suppose technically still is. And yeah, I started out in Z and moved, up, there. and moved up to B. And we both used to be fairly decent golfers yeah. back, back when we used to play all the fucking time. But it's not like riding a bike. If you don't practice, you yep. get bad. Yep. It is a hard game. It takes a lot of practice. Oh, what the hell? Well, we, we didn't want to be in that ditch. Yeah, Marcus, I don't know, man. Um, I don't know how they're going to do it. I mean, I think they're going to open up. Nice. Oh, that's what I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah, I mean, depending on where you live... Um, you can golf. You just can't go and have beers and hot dogs in the uh, restaurant area. But it's asinine that people can't golf. I know. It's out in the middle of a, a shitload of, you know, open space. Biarritz. Okay. Yep. I learned something. This is a Biarritz green. Well, 
that that depends on on the firmness and 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 the speed of the greens. If you've yeah. got a really soft green, soft slow, for instance, they're not gonna they're not gonna run very much. And you know you can adjust the speed on any course that you play. And the firmness. Joseph of England, right? So yep. if you don't, you know, if it plays too fast, you can go in and change that, the speed yep. and the firmness on yep. any course, anytime you want. Yeah. Which is a nice touch because they never it had is. that in TGC 2. Or was it 1? Did they change that no, in 2? Two, 2 you still had to play the defaults, yeah. whatever it was. Yeah, that's right. 2019 they gave us the control. Yeah, that that those were the two big things. So you had that and then you had... Uh, uh, where you could fast forward the shots. That was right. beautiful. Yeah, I love that. I mean, Bavakian. it cuts, cuts the gameplay in half. Jesus, Bavakian. You guys all know so much about the course design. 24. Look at the berm on the front of that green. Nice. Mm. Oh, look at that gully down there on the yeah. left of the mm -hmm. green on the green i should say um what are we yeah doing? that's true yep prairie hawk that's 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 always been a pet peeve of mine too i remember hey Kent, do you remember in tgc1 where the the um fringe of the green was like uh rubber <laughs> remember yeah. yep if you hit if your ball hit the fringe it was boing and it would like bounce all the fucking way like 25 oh there's miles. that hole i was saying yeah you don't want to go down there Yep. Yeah. I'm, I'm, yeah. I'm really glad they fixed that because they used to just annoy the crap out of me. Like, this is not acting like uh, real grass here. It's not made out of fucking rubber. Twenty four clicks. Am I right? I am. Ha ha ha. Sweet. <laughs> Zero clicks. Yeah, the retaining walls. Yeah. You hit a retaining it was like BAM add another four hundred yards to your shot. <laughs> <laughs> like what the hell is that thing made out of? <laughs> well, remember I hit remember um I forget what course we were playing and I hit it right through the retain the rocks or retaining walls or whatever. Mm-hmm. So that's unrealistic, but that's a good thing. Oh, look at his screen. That is so cool. There's an H-shaped bunker, an L-shaped bunker. This is really kick-ass. I'm digging this course. I thought, oh, slow. Actually, that should be okay. Yeah, that's exactly where I wanted it. Excellent. <clears throat> Well, it's not a deep bunker like the one I was in. True. I don't think I can... You rolled in. I'll probably plug. Let's see. I should have just clubbed down. I had to be a dick. Yeah, well, well I'm doing the same thing. I'm going to get there in my second shot. Right. Oh, you did plug it. Right, I had to try it. No, it rolled. Right. Oh, 98% shift. That's not bad. Let me see here. Oh, well, looks okay. I could four putt that. Indeed. Well, I'm two under and you're two over. So remember, next round we have to reverse it so that you kick my ass and I'm way over. No, that shit's done with, man. I can't play <coughs> anymore at all. Zero. <laughs> Zero. Okay. But whatever. It's cool just to play freaking. It is. And I'm really Good enjoying courses. this round. Yeah. You know? this, is, this is a hell of a fun course to play. Give me a freaking break. All right. No, it's going to go right. I knew it. Oh, well, almost went the side door. It almost went in. That's what she said. <clears throat> no, she said, what do you mean put it in? I'm done. <laughs> All right. Oh, you already put it in. Oh, I didn't even notice. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Oh, oh. oh really. that's pretty funny. That works. Yeah, these are some stellar scores we're racking up here. Yeah. 
but I'm having fun. Uh, we're both on the Steam controller. Yeah. Still have it. Even though, according to Kemp, they don't even make them anymore. Yeah, they discontinued them. Damn it. I better be careful with this, because I don't want to have to learn how to use a Xbox or... What's the other one? PS uh, controller PS4 or whatever. PS4 controller. You know, I, I want to... I'm comfortable with this one. I like it. As you can tell from my mind-blowing plane. No, I've got... Yeah, I've got two of them. And the pathetic thing is, is I really could play the swing well if I paid attention. You know, like, actually thought about the joystick. But I'm not, <coughs> you know, and it's like, oh, yeah. I'm just not paying attention. Oh, yeah. Actually, we are playing another course <coughs> that was suggested on the on the forums. Although I'm not... I'm not uh, yeah, Prairie. Say, go I'm over sorry. to tgctours.com. Go into our section because we're booked today. Oh, Jesus! And Christ. next week already. Okay, so uh, you know we we play two courses each show, and we just go by the forums. So if you go into the forums, uh, go into the TGC. I think it's course review. Is it still called TGC Course Review? Yeah, it hasn't <laughs> changed, I don't think. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah, so yeah, that's um, cool, dude. We'll, yeah, put it in there. We'll we'll check it out. You bet. Have to be a different show, but yeah, yeah, we'd be happy to. Bavaki and you and your mouse. I don't know how the hell you can play this game with a mouse. What's next week? I don't know. Um, let me see. That was just a. Beautiful, beautiful shot. Bear with me, guys. Let's see. Oh, my God. I'm sucking. Uh, TGC Course Review, I think. Yeah. TGC Course Review. It's under the first section. I'll shoot the this. link. We used to have a show called that. Now it's called The LiDAR King. <laughs> 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 so there's the there's the forum section. Just go there, put your course in the uh, the area. Where is it? Course submissions and suggestions. Put it in there. So next week, I believe. Let me look at the bottom here. the hell is this page one okay hey there's Aaron how's it going man we're gearing up to play your course second now hey Aaron what's up buddy the edge of wilderness as opposed to smack dab in the wilderness doesn't have quite the ring to it. Now miss to the left and roll forever. Oh, okay. I it. And I still bogey. Shit. Yeah, I mean, now we're uh, we're doing beginner designers today. So you and. <laughs> This one here are uh, both on here. So. Yeah, we were going to call it Goat Track Orama, but we thought that was a little cool. So, sarcasm off. This is an awesome course, and so is Aaron's. I haven't played Aaron's yet, so. Oh, that's right. You're in for a treat. The lighting, the edge of the <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that was probably the only thing that I, I was uh, slightly disappointed with. Is that well, I'm gonna all the details the were in the shadow? A okay, cool. All right, because uh, the lighting's yet. a little dark, but right. so I'll be a dick and changes. I, I was I was like on fourteen or fifteen, and suddenly it was like the sun came out, um, and it just lit up the the fairway suddenly, and I was like, yeah, that's right, and then it went back behind the clouds. So my one criticism would be I wished it was lighter, but 
just because it's such a beautiful course, I want to see every detail. Yeah. I, I mean that in a good way. Yeah, remember that one course we played? I don't know. Was it Bavakian? No, I don't know whose it was. But it was over... It was a Lynx course, and the guy had it so dark. It was such a gorgeous course. But you couldn't see... I mean, I couldn't see my ball behind. I yeah. do remember that. Remember yeah, that? I do. Yeah, it was like we the, we were we kept trying to say what a great course it was, but it was like, you know, it was like nine o'clock at night or some shit because right. it was so dark. Yeah, and I remember we played it again, and I cranked it up to, you know, eleven in the morning with sun. Shit. And. You couldn't believe how gorgeous the course really was once you got some yeah. light on it. Yeah, you know. Sometimes they pick. Sometimes they'll 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 do the thing with too many clouds and and or the the uh, mm. interval between clouds. So you know, sometimes when the sun comes out, then everything looks great. But right. if you have a round where the clouds don't move much or whatever, then it spends you spend your whole round basically in cloudy conditions. You can't see shit. Yeah, so. it's not fun. Yeah, and I mean his, you know, his justification was it was over in Ireland, and it's always, it's always rainy and cloudy. I think I've played how many hole we played, how many courses with a hole like this? Lots, actually. You know what I mean? Like with that bowl on hey, the par three. Okay, you guys, you you professional Bavakian and so forth. W what do you call this green? Is there a name for this? Told us the other one. They seem to know what every single template is called. So is this a template hole here, where it's like a like a, a bowl? And, oh, very. It doesn't fucking matter because I can't even find it. A thumbprint. Oh, a thumbprint. Okay. Thank you, Bear. I swear to God. I Air for talking. life. What's up, buddy? Come back. Yeah. Oh, I thought that almost went in. Well, you're going to par it. Oh, thank God. After that horrible, horrible drive. Well, I'm just going to put it straight. A short template with a thumbprint. These guys know their uh, golf design. Holy their shit. Art, I might architecture. actually get back to even par. No, it's not going to happen. You're no. probably right. <laughs> yeah, I don't. I bad. don't have a freaking clue. I mean, between uh, Adam, Ariel, Adam, and Dylan, I mean, they're all like, "Oh, yeah, template hole. This is a template hole." I'm like, "What the fuck is a template hole?" And yeah, they know their golf course architecture. Big yep, time. they do, man. Yep, Dylan especially, man. He can fucking. He quote shit. He knows now, something's every course, wrong every because that's two drives in a row that I had a good snap. So, all right, guys, the show's over. Later. <laughs> I'm going to leave on a good note. But, yeah, so I will never use this theme again since the only one that's not handicapped is this theme. I just, superstition. <laughs> now, this is what? Is this autumn or what's the other one? You have autumn and there's one that's harvest. 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 What's the difference? Uh, one think, has, doesn't uh, have any green trees, right? I think the colors are more pronounced. I can't, you know, I honestly can't remember now. I think the autumn one is more colorful than the harvest, but I'm not sure. Anybody know, guys? What's the difference between the autumn and the harvest? I think one has no green trees. This one does. So this Kick. is like a mix. That's coming back. I don't know far, though. Not very far. Exactly, Bear. That's that's the way I've always done it. I mean, I've gotten some inspiration on some holes from real life courses or designers, but I I'm not a I'm not an architect. Three shots in a row, I hit it. I know what looks good and what I I think plays well, and that's what I do. What's that, Greg? When I'm designing, I'm not a I, I'm not a student of golf course architecture. No. I mean, uh, there's certain designers that I I love and certain courses that I admire, but I'm not a fucking genius about any of that shit. 
like some of these guys know. I mean, as, as many courses as I've built, and I notice I say that instead of design, Ooh. design squat, but, you know, like right now, I'm doing a Pete Dye course, and freaking thing's gorgeous, but I wouldn't know one Pete Dye hole from another. Mm -hmm. You know, I just, I don't know, I, just, I don't know them. Well, it's an art and a science and uh, culture built up around it. It's awesome. And I respect the hell out of people that have studied it in depth. But I just... Like I, I just told another guy, um, go there. Put a request in. Um, in the course submission. Because right now, uh, we are booked today. Uh, next Saturday already. And we play a couple. All right. Yeah, that's true. Maddie, I think, does. I can say my favorite design time is Tom Doak. I just love his shit. Did a lot of his courses in depth. Now that is a square green. Look at that. Oh, this pin position is. Okay. Jesus. Another. Now I aimed it in. Yeah, approach shot should be fun in this one. This pin is just uh, difficult. Yeah, go under the tree, Greg. Right? Yeah, bear. yeah, that's cool, Bear. Yeah, cool. just let us post in the forums under the course submission uh, section. Oh, I got it straight. You know what? I'll take that. It's better yeah. than going left and going down on that second tier. 100-yard putt. All right. I do have a shot. Oh, my God. Look at that freaking area. Yep. I know. Holy this shit. pin. This the one that wanted pin for. All right. So we've got 146, 140. Holy shit. I got a hit. I got the three wood. I'm going to grab a six iron. Okay. He's going to ignore my advice. I was just trying to help. Oh, oh, wow. Kept going. Six iron to get out of a 125 yard. That lie was nasty. Yeah, in between rounds, dude, because. Uh, Close too boring? Yeah, it is. I mean, I'm falling asleep there. <laughs> I'm used to having <laughs> your clothing and nothing's happening. <laughs> Oh, I was hoping we both birdied the very last hole. Of course not. No. And well, I'm right. on the happy side of par. 